Jai Gurudev, my name is Adya and I am studying in grade 8. Today I will be speaking on Adhikamasa and the two ways in which calendars are calculated, mainly solar and lunar calendar. The difference between the two calendars is the celestial body used to measure the passage of time. The lunar calendar uses the phases of the moon to measure time, usually measuring time from one new moon to the next new moon as one month. The the time taken by the Earth to rotate around the Sun makes up one solar year. The solar calendar typically measures time between vernal equinoxes. In the Hindu calendar, there is a Adhikamasa or extra month. This month is dedicated to Sri Krishna. The Hindu calendar is lunar and follows the phases of the moon. A lunar month is 29.5 days long, while a solar month is 30 to 31 days long. Vashishta Siddhanta, a treatise of sage Vashishta, once said that the Adhikamasa occurs after every 32 months, 16 days and 8 gadis, in which a gadi is 24 minutes. A lunar year consists of 354 days, while a solar year consists of 365 days. As so, as years pass by, each lunar month starts earlier than the corresponding solar month. So, this makes a difference of 11 days between the two years. After two or three years, the difference between the two calendars becomes a full month or around 29 days. To compensate and get the two calendars equal, an extra month is added. This month is called Adhikamasa. I hope this information has been useful to you. So, thank you and Jai Gurudev. I hope this information has been useful to you. So thank you and Jai Gurudev.